السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس آف کلاس نائن ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹ اسٹوڈی وی ول اسٹڈی ون آف دا ڈیزیز دیٹ از کولڈرا کولڈرا ایز یو نو از این ایکیوٹ انفیکشس اٹ از اے فیٹل ڈیزیز اینڈ اٹ از کامن جورنگ دا اوور کراؤڈیڈ فیورس فیسٹیولز اینڈ آفٹر کلاؤڈس so cholera occurs in epidemic form epidemic means wide and district with occurrence separate over a large population cholera is caused by the bacteria vibro cholera so cholera is bacterial disease caused by the bacteria vibro cholera it is transmitted by flies contaminated water and food so the mode of transmission is contaminated water it is caused when there is poor sanitation see here in the incubation period of cholera is generally few hours to three or more days when the bacteria of cholera is injected they multiply in a small intestinal and invades its epithelial cells when the bacteria die they release toxic which irritates the intestinal lining and led to secretion of large amount of water and salts so there are some of the symptoms of cholera that is water diarrhea watery diarrhea effortless vomiting without nausea great loss of minerals salts and body fluids kidney failure leads to kidney failure eyes of patient is become shrunken so it can be prevented by using vaccine vaccination is the prevention in cold or cold area boiled water and cooked food should be taken care for personal hygiene and good sanitation in community are the only certain protection against cold and there are some controlling measures of this cold is for preventing dehydration therapy with oral rehydration or a solution is done immediately so this or a solution will help in preventing the control of cholera disease immediate medical advice should be taken antibiotics or tetracycline kill the bacteria of cholera so these are some of the uh, control measures these are the prevention is how can we prevent and these are the uh, this symptoms so in order to overcome we can see the cholera is a bacterial disease caused by the bacteria vibro cholera it is caused to become contaminated food it is water borne disease so uh, to control it we have to go for the proper good hygiene well sanitation and also use of antibiotics that is tetracycline is used to kill the cholera bacteria they are students stay connected